I'm a youth organizer here at REAP. REAP stands for Roxbury Environmental Empowerment Project, and I fight for environmental justice. And one of the main reasons why we focus on this is because we want to reduce the rate of asthma in our community. As part of the Stop Dirty Diesel campaign, REAP and others testified at a city council hearing held on December 20th. According to the Health of Boston report, young children, teens, the elderly, African Americans, and Latinos have the highest rate of asthma. Roxbury, Dorchester, and the South End in Mattapan have the highest asthma hospitalization rate for children under five and more than five times the state average. Clean air means that less people will be going to the emergency rooms and less people will be missing school and work and stuff like that. It's important because people shouldn't be missing school for health reasons such as asthma attacks or cardiovascular illnesses. Diesel pollution in Suffolk County um, contributes annually to 43 premature deaths and 7,350 lost work days. We are part of the worst 1% of the counties in the country of diesel pollution. Our campaign, Asthma, Asthma and Diesel, is about getting retrofits on city-owned vehicles, construction trucks, to change them from diesel to cleaner fuel. In the public sector, we want the Boston City Council to pass a diesel emissions reduction or clean construction ordinance. In terms of the private sector goals of this campaign, we're hoping that we're setting example in the private sector and through our advocacy to encourage private institutions like hospitals and universities to adopt their own clean construction policies. Environmental justice is about residents from low-income communities and communities of color having a say in what happens in their neighborhood. And this hearing is a wonderful example of young people from our EJ community leading the direction of our city's future. Since when is exposing a dangerous toxin like diesel emission fuels to anyone okay? Because of careless decisions like that, Myself, as well as countless of others, are cursed with things such as asthma, diabetes, lung cancers, and a whole bunch of health concerns that no one deserves to be hassled with. On one occasion, I was left out of school for about a week because of my asthma and breathing problems. I want to address the question of cost. Cost cannot await the health and well-being of the residents of Boston. Cost cannot await the survival of those living with chronic health conditions. Investing in diesel emission reduction is a smart policy because it saves money in the long run. For every, do every dollar we spend retrofitting diesel engines, we sell $12 preventing health care costs such as emergency room visits and preventing lo lost work days. This type of prevention needs to be our priority. This campaign success impacts me because since I was born, I always had asthma. And so that always has affected me in doing sports and any of the physical activities that I wanted. Together we can stop dirty diesel pollution in the city of Boston and create healthy communities with the less of a burden from asthma and other pollution related health problems.